Hey, what is up everybody? I'm Riz and welcome to my channel. In this quick and awesome video, I'm going to teach you how you can mirror your phone to your TV. This is not an Android TV, by the way, so don't worry about that. It's completely free and the best part is that you don't need home Wi-Fi to do this. And you don't need to download any third-party apps. It works with any Android phone you have and it, work it literally works with and it also works with any TV you have. Yeah, so let's just dive right into it. All right, so a couple of things before we start. As I just said, you don't need home Wi-Fi in this case. So the first thing you want to do on your on your phone or any device you have is go to your settings and go to your network settings. Okay, so the ideal the ideal case would be to use your home Wi-Fi because it's free, it's available and stuff. So, but what? But but what if it's not available? The first thing you want to do is to make sure you have some sort of a hotspot. So in this video, we're going to be using hotspot instead of home Wi-Fi. So it doesn't matter if it's running, if the hotspot is coming from your mobile phone, it can be from your laptop, can be from your desktop computer. It doesn't matter what's the, uh, you know, where the hotspot is coming from, as long as there is a hotspot. So in this case, just for the sake of this video, I'm going to turn on hotspot from my mobile phone. So just be careful with the mobile hotspot. It's not free, okay? Depending on what network you have. So once the hotspot, once the hotspot is running, the first thing you want to do on your TV, this is 11 years old TV, by the way. This is not Android, okay? So the first thing you want to do on your TV is to head over to your network settings. And if you look into your network settings, you have Wi-Fi direct option. That basically means your TV can also create a hotspot. I mean, if you have the option, you can use a TV as a hotspot as well, okay? So just for the, you know, I'm just giving you example that you can use whatever hotspot that is available to you, okay? I'm sorry if I'm talking too fast. All right, so now once the hotspot is running on whatever device you have, in this case, my phone, my mobile phone actually, go to your network settings and let the TV search for that hotspot. So in this case, the top one is actually my home Wi-Fi and the bottom, the Edge Plus, is basically the hotspot that is running on my Android smartphone as, as I just showed you. So now what you want to do is to basically connect your TV to that hotspot of your phone, of your uh, you know laptop or your desktop computer, whatever you have, it doesn't matter where the hotspot is coming from. Okay, I'm saying it, I'm saying it again and again because most people just you know, I'm just saying that you need you don't need you know you don't have to worry about the hotspot is coming from. Okay, so enter the Wi-Fi, enter the hotspot password. In this case, mine is one two eight, and that's really simple, nothing fancy at all, and just click done. It will automatically connect your TV to that hotspot that is enabled. Okay, so by the way, just be careful with the hotspot settings, depending on where you live, depending on what network you have, it might not be free, okay? So just be careful with it, okay? Don't go crazy with it. All right, so once the, hot, once the TV is connected, if you look closer into the uh, network settings, you have the option for the screen mirroring t uh, option. And you can also find that in the source option as well. But since this is a really old TV, so we have to manually enable the screen mirroring mode, okay? But if you have a, if you have a latest uh, version of this, uh, you know, whatever TV you have, you don't need to do that. All right, so there's a couple ways you can mirror your phone to your TV. The first one is going to be the control center. Inside the control center, you'll find the cast option or you could go to the settings and go to your connected connected device settings okay now inside the connected device settings head over to the connection preferences until you find the cast option okay by the way you can also also search for the cast option depending on what model of a uh, brand of mobile phone you have in this case this is a motorola so it's running stock android but you can definitely search for screencast screen mirroring mirror cast whatever you like okay so in this case it's cast really simple so head over to the cast option and as you can see there is no devices nearby so we have to manually enable for the older TVs, okay? So in this case, we have to manually enable the wireless display for older generation of TVs. So there you go, it's connecting. Find your TV, and as you can see right in the background, it's connecting in the back. So it's just a couple, wait a couple of seconds depending on how fast your hotspot actually is. There you go. And by the way, this is trackpad. You don't, I mean, you can use as a trackpad, but this is it. It's done. Pretty, pretty awesome, right? By the way, if you have any questions, do let me know in the coming section below. I will definitely, definitely get back to you, okay? And uh, if you, if this video is helpful, leave a like, comment, of course, and do not forget to subscribe, okay? By the way, you can do a lot with this. You can watch YouTube if you want to. You can listen to Spotify. You can even use your Instagram if you want to. By the way, 
if you are insta if you are on the instagram be sure to give me a follow a lot of great content there as well okay but by the way the audio will be coming from tv as well you can switch that in the settings or yeah in the settings actually so uh but this is it for the video also keep watching till the end because i'm going to show you how you can disconnect as well but that's it for me i'll catch you in the next one thank you for watching peace out